Baidu is currently the principal search engine in China, and China is a huge country with over 1 billion people. That's a lot of potential internet users doing a lot of searching. Here are some interesting stats before I start. In the year 2000, there was only 22 million people with access to the internet. That's just 1.7% of the population. But by the year 2011, that number went up to 513 million, an astonishing 2,180% increase. Baidu, with 78% share of the search engine market, had over 400 million users in 2011. Just to put this into perspective, that's almost double of Google UK and US users put together. If the amount of internet users continues to increase the level of UK and US, China would have almost a billion users, with more than 700 million of these using Baidu. That's a lot of searches on the same search engine. Needless to say, Baidu is an essential growth area for any business hoping to maintain a strong global presence. And in this video, I will be going through the basic on-page and technical SEO elements you will need to start dominating Baidu. Compared to Google, Baidu's cooler and ranking algorithm is still not as advanced, so it relies heavily on on-page information, which is why it's very important to get this spot on. The first thing I'll be talking about is demand name. Uh, make sure you're using the Chinese TDL. Uh, Baidu will rank these primarily. Uh, these are .cn and .com.cn. Um, another thing is make sure your website is hosted in China. Uh, I was actually in China last year and uh, I was trying to browse some UK websites and they were painfully slow, almost to the point of unbrowsable. So it's very important to be hosted in China locally. Uh, next up is Baidu Webmaster Tours. Um, Baidu has, has have, have their own Webmaster Tours, same as Google and Bing. Uh, it's not as advanced but you will be able to submit information such as sitemap.xml, um, robot.txt, um, check your website for errors, among other things. It is in Chinese, being that it's from China, uh, um, but uh, Google does a pretty good job of translating it if you're on Chrome, so uh, give that a go. Next up is Meta. Uh, description and title is the same. Uh, they're very important. Make sure um, you're, they're optimized for each page, they're unique, etc. Uh, the key difference here is that Baidu still reads meta keywords, so make sure this is present on your website, um, optimized for the keywords you're targeting for those specific pages. Um, next up is content. Um, Baidu does rank English content. Uh, they have partner up, partnered up with Bing recently to um, display English results, um, but this is halfway down the page. So um, if you want to dominate Baidu, you will need to use simplified Chinese. Uh, you don't have to learn Chinese um, if, you, if you don't know how to, how to write Chinese, um, get a translator, translate your website, um, but make sure it's in Chinese, it's very important. Uh, next up, um, just one more thing before I move on actually, uh, the government has placed a censorship on keywords, on certain keywords, so uh, make sure you do your research, check there's no censored keywords on your website, because it will mean your website will be de-indexed if there are. Uh, next up is header, Baidu placed the uh, same, if not more importance, on on-page elements such as header and alt tags. Uh, like I said before, the algorithm is not as advanced, so rely on your website for information. Make sure these are optimized. Uh, next up is website code. Uh, make sure this is the same as Google. Make sure you stay away from flash, um, frames, etc. Anything that the coolers cannot read, um, you don't want on your website. Make sure your website code is clean, is fast, um, it will help with your rankings. Uh, lastly, it's the website structure. Um, Baidu's coolers will not cool as many or as deep as Google's coolers. It's not as advanced, so make sure the important pages you want to rank are on the top level. Uh, make sure your menu is not going down too deep to uh, maybe beyond third level. Um, keeping it simple, it's really important. Uh, that's it for my part one of my SEO guide, uh, by, by do SEO guide. Um, my second part, I'll be talking about link building, analytics, among other factors. So um, make sure you stay tuned for that. Um, thank you.